Paper surrounds us. We use it for so many things every day. Since 1990, Americans have recycled 1 billion tons of paper. Last year, the U.S. recycled 315 pounds of paper from commercial and residential sources for every person living in the country. So do you ever wonder what happens to that piece of paper you toss in the recycle bin? It begins when paper is collected by a recycler and sorted by type. Then it is processed into one of dozens of grades for sale to the paper mill. Recycled paper accounts for 36% of the U.S. paper industry's fiber needs annually. 76% of mills in the U.S. use recycled materials to make their paper. First, water is added to break the fibers apart and remove non-paper contaminants. Next, it is turned into a pulp. Then it is dried through high-speed rollers and produced into a new sheet of fiber. Your sheet of paper could become tissue, newsprint, office paper, or even a box. It's no surprise that recycling benefits the environment. Recovering one ton of paper saves 17 trees, 79 gallons of oil, and 7,000 gallons of water, adding up to a 68% energy savings. The U.S. and global economic benefits are massive as well. In 2013, recycled paper was a $7.5 billion industry in the United States, and this commodity was exported to more than 85 countries, valued at $3.2 billion. Conserving the environment, fueling the economy, and producing a vital product, paper recycling is a major asset to our economy and our planet.